Hey what's up people, welcome back to another video and today we're breaking down some film on running back from South Dakota State, Pierre Strong. This is one of my favorite late round players, just really explosive athlete with his burst, his flexible lower half, fits really good in an outside zone scheme, so let's get right into this one. So we got an outside zone run here from Strong, he does a really good job of IDing the leverage, really flexible lower half, good burst, really explosive player, so let's just watch this, sees 11 set the edge. Works back into the inside. Look how good those cuts are. Like really good flexible feet. Good ankle flexion to make those cuts. 11 sets the edge. Reads this. Finds the hole. Good vision. Making these cuts just flexible lower half. Ankle flexion. Hip flexion. Really good fluidity. Now let's watch this. 11 sets the edge. Outside's shoulder. He's already working back to the inside to 94. Sees him set the edge here. But he knows 75 is the inside. So he presses. Allows his O-line to gain the outside leverage, then makes quick de decisions. So I really like his fit in an outside zone to just get upfield with his burst and then make people miss at the second level with those flexible hips and ankles at the, ne like at the next level. So really good stuff from Strong here. We got some really good decisiveness here from Strong. He can, he has the speed to bounce it to the outside, but he also has the awareness to bang through the holes or knowing when to bend it back. So he reads the leverage here pretty quickly and just bends it back. Good job just getting those two feet down. Bends it back. Good explosiveness. Works through contact a little bit there at the end. So ID is the flow. Defense flows really fast outside. He sees the hole could open up right here. But he presses. Sees this guy get the inside leverage on the tight end. Two feet. Bounce it back. Bounce it back. Then he's got a one-on-one -on -one with a safety. Probably could have beat him there, but just a really efficient run from Strong. That's why I like his fit in the outside zone. Good lower body flexion. I like the body lean that he plays with. Quick vision. Just the flexibility is really impressive, along with the explosiveness to break out these long plays. Because he's got the quickness to make people miss in those tight spaces, but also the burst and long speed to make explosive long plays. So really good stuff from Strong more split flow action here this time in gun so we can really see him in a different scenario but uh guy sets the edge presses up gets to the outside manipulate the second level defender then burst up like just a perfect fit in these outside zone schemes like sees this guy set the edge already sees the like the hole opening up right here so he presses up into the hole then starts to bounce it a little to the outside to get this guy and the safety to commit the outside then boom has the good footwork the flexible lower half to just stick that foot in the ground get up field like love the flexibility in the lower half like that's what a running back needs to really excel and be special at the next level i saw someone on twitter that i trust uh compare him to tony pollard i think that's a really good comparison he's gonna be like a strong number two running back early in his career that could turn into a full three down player because he can make an impact in the passing game needs to work on his pass bro but definitely has the skills to where he can do the work in pass pro and i love his ability as a runner just to make these quick decisions cut up field with burst flex flexibility in the lower half as i've been saying the whole video but yeah really good stuff from strong i just wanted to show off his big playability in this clip showing it from this angle because it's better just be able to just identify what's going on, even runs into his blocker, breaks tackles, just being able to turn those hips quickly, and you can see the long speed right there. We'll show it again and break it down a little slower. I mean, three guys come in unblocked off the rip here. Like, this is really impressive. Slow plays it, just sticks the foot in the ground, just plays with really good body lean low. I just love that. Presses up, even runs into his block, but doesn't let that stop him. Shows off some balance. Sticks that foot in the ground. Stiff arm, and is able. To, he just runs away from everyone. Just not many people can create when three people are unblocked into the backfield. This is what sets away running backs to make them special is when they're able to create when not everything goes as planned. Because let's be honest, in the NFL, not every block goes as planned. There's amazing defensive players. They blow up plays all the time. And if you can create even when things are going wrong, that's when you become a special player at the next level. So that was the last clip that I wanted to show. 
Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you didn't, then uh, later. So, yeah. Peace, guys.